This sunny spring weather probably has you thinking about sprucing up your yard, and you can still do it and also stretch your dollar. Yeah, it's that time of the year. You're going to be spending extra time outside. So News 8's Laura Hutchinson shows us how you can stretch your dollar in the garden tonight. If you're juggling work and kids, it's likely you don't really have the time or the money to put into your landscaping as you'd like to. But the experts say there are a few low cost, low maintenance things you could do to give your yard that pop of color you're looking for. Spring weather is here, and for many, it's time to fix up the lawn. Landscaping can be very expensive, but Tarantino Landscaping's Don Dixon showed us there are ways to fix up your yard without spending a lot. One of the most important things is actually one of the cheaper things. It just involves labor. It's primarily just cleaning the beds, cleaning the lawns taking out any dead leaves and debris from the winter. Even the smallest budget can get you something. He suggests splitting your money and buying some perennials that will come back year after year and some annuals that are cheap and brighten things up now. The most popular, of course, are some of the begonias, um, impatience, um, and the old standby marigolds and geraniums and things. In the perennials, we use a lot of daylilies, the still bees, um, a lot of different color. A lot of them will last year through the entire season. Planting ornamental grass, new grass, or just laying down some fresh mulch is another easy way to clean things up without overspending. And if you still have questions, he says experts are there to help keep you on budget. We try to make it so that it works best for their, their property and their lifestyle. If you're still not sure about what you want to do with your yard and you don't think you have the money to hire the experts, there is an app that can help you out. You actually use a picture of your house and the app will help you determine which trees or plants would look the best in your yard. It's pretty convenient if you want to try it out. I'll link you to that on our website, WTNH.com. Helping you stretch your dollar. I'm Laura Hutchinson, News 8.